So guys, Orlando Pirates have a midfield in Goodman Mosele, who is only 23 years old. He initially had a positive start, uh, you know, uh, this uh, previous season. Um, he started well, you know, the first six games in the league under the new coach Jose Rivera. But things have not been the same for him since he got injured. I remember he had a shoulder injury and he has been missing. In fact, uh, Goodman Musele has never been involved in our net bank cup run. So his agent has provided an update on what is really happening with this 23-year-old. We agent Dakege um Utige uh Utu Goodman Musele had an injury. I think it was in the derby against Kaiser Chiefs. He has taken some time to come back and obviously, you know, you've got to fight for your place. Pirates have been doing very well and it's not always easy to just go back straight in. But look, I'm confident in Goodman, he will get a good pre-season in, into his legs and start the new season where he left off before. So that's where we are with Goodman. So guys, that is the update coming from Goodman Mosele's agent, Paul Michel, to say good to you. You know, yeah, um, obviously the injury did distract uh, Mosele and even when he comes back from it, he wouldn't have been able to just go straight into the starting 11. But the preseason is the time that they will use to get him back into full fitness and to compete for his position. So definitely, Goodman Mosele, according to the agent, is going to return next season. In accordance with Isoka Latuma, it looks like KZ Chiefs have acquired yet the services of another quality player. Kaiser Chiefs have agreed personal terms with the Venezuela international midfielder Edson Castillo. Edson Castillo is comfortable to play as an 8. He can also play as a 6, so he can play as a defensive midfield and a central midfield. In January, I remember I made a video about this player. Kaiser Chiefs was interested in him, but they opted uh, against signing him at that time. And he was a free agent at that time. So... When Chiefs decided not to sign him, he went back, you know, to his former club, which is um, uh, Manakas, on a short-term deal. So, according to Iso, uh, Ilo, Itiski Times Manje, Utio Age Amakosi, um, reopened talks at the end of the 2022-2023 season, and the two parties have come to an agreement, you know, in terms of personal terms, and he is expected to join Amakosi. So, there you have it, Ige Bafetu. We will see. Um, what is going to happen if KZ Chiefs will make this, you know, final. But since they agreed personal terms, I think it shouldn't be a problem in terms of acquiring the services of this player. 